Tenants at Movie Town Port of Spain will have to seek legal advice to determine, get this, who they should pay their rent to at the end of this week. The peculiar dilemma follows last Friday's attempted takeover led by the Port Authority and Port of Spain Infrastructure Company Limited, which owns the land at Invaders Bay. Businessman Derek Chin, along with his business partners, who lease the property under the entity Trinbago Commercial Development Company Limited, had their day in court over the almost $11 million debt owed to Pasinko. TCDC agreed that it would pay $3 million to the court, which will be held in escrow until the case over the arrears is determined, and Pasinko agreed not to interfere with the leases and operations of the tenants. The judge, however, decided not to make a determination on who should be collecting rent from tenants. Instead, the judge left it open to tenants to decide if they want to continue paying their landlord, TCDC, Persinko, or pay directly to the court. The court's decision not to make a decision has left several tenants uneasy and confused. You don't pay a clear gain invoice, so until somebody gives me an invoice, I can't do anything. I can only put the money aside in my in my accounts until such time. I don't think the court has any um has a clue what our rent what our rates are. Another tenant told CNC3 News that they believe it's an internal issue that should not trickle down to the tenants. But if there is a change in management, they hope there's no rent increase and that issues such as leaks and flooding are addressed quickly. When CNC3 News visited Movie Town around midday on Monday, it was business as usual as the cinema, restaurants, clothing and toy stores were all open to the public. And while TCDC's security appeared overly suspicious of everyone, especially the media, shoppers appeared unbothered by any of the recent activities. Kimari Fletcher, CNC3 News.